On our way to Xi'an. Actually, on our way to Beijing first. 16 hours. <laughs> so after 16 hours, we finally arrived in Beijing. The mountains kind of remind me of um, California. Let me see if I can show you. There are mountains there. Uh -huh. <laughs> I know, it's pretty. It kind of reminded me in California. I'm not really sure if you can see it. The plane ride was interesting. Being little definitely helps because I could curl up in a ball and go to sleep when I wanted to. Um, it was four hours Chicago to Seattle and then 12 hours from Seattle to Beijing. And it went by pretty fast. It only felt like six because I was asleep all, the whole time, well, half the time. And then I was up walking around a little bit. We had some food. They turned the lights off, you know, the normal international thing. And, uh, yeah, um, that's pretty much it. I was pretty mad because the... Um, the security guard took my vitamin water that I had been saving. <laughs> she was mad about the vitamin water. It wasn't just once, it was twice. She lost one, got another one. I heard it all. We'll buy you case when we get there. Right. I'm pretty sure we got vitamin water here. They, they better. I'm glad you guys are in such they good better. moods. We're walking. We're ranting about all Yeah. We're ranting about You got to get it out. All the I'm walking. I have it on my camcorder. I'm doing it on my phone. And I don't speak any lick of Chinese, so I don't know what the world these people are saying. Everything is just hand gestures and <laughs> them kind of guiding me places and telling me no. So the little English they speak with the little bit of nothing of Chinese that I speak, we learn to communicate. <laughs> um, hopefully I'll be learning how to say thank you and... Even hello, like I, I literally know nothing. Thank you, hello, and sorry. I think those are going to be like my first words that I need to learn. So, yeah. We're waiting like two more hours until we fly to Xi'an. So now we're just sitting here waiting in the little area. And I'm chilling out. I haven't tried to eat anything yet because I don't know how to ask. I don't know how much money it is. I need to learn some stuff. <laughs> so until next time. So we get to Xi'an. And we're driving on the wrong side of the road. What? What? I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> and there's several cars coming. Look at that. Goodness. Alright. If we don't die, <laughs> I'll vlog later. My room! Bathroom! We got closets over here, beds that look really flat, <laughs> TV, a nice TV, AC, a fridge, and some more stuff. We're going out right now. Walking around. So many street vendors. It's kind of like Spain. Street vendors everywhere, selling everything you could possibly need. And there's crazy amount of people. Oh my God. 
taking my first cab in Xi'an. Emily's with me, of course. <laughs> Shoot, I wouldn't have it any other way. There's a TV passing by. So there's no like actual street lights in China, I found out. I think it's something about electricity savings. Do you guys see the steam coming out of the ground? We're going to a club! Woo -woo. Oh, it's so cool. Alright, see you when I get there. Just got out of the taxi. Downtown Xi'an. Oh, we're gonna oh, go to this breath. club. It's changing. Oh, it changes colors. It's cool. There's a KFC. We passed a freaking Walmart. Yes, I saw. That. On our way oh, here. Excited. And. So we're getting lunch in the cafeteria. Can't read anything, no prices. Tim's in the video. Em's <laughs> in the video. Um, yeah, it's like 500 degrees in here. I'm gonna get some rice and some chicken. We are eating right now some lunch. Kung Pao chicken. Some of this stuff is really good. I'm using chopsticks. I could not use these yesterday. This is awesome. The Chinese army training practice. Just got back from the store. Got some more hangers. Just walking on campus. Down the street. Yeah. 